After rough milling, the blank is sawn away, leaving the oversized extractor ready to be filed up and fit to the chopper lump barrels. A large round file quickly removes the bulk of metal surrounding the scribe lines. Having the extractor oversized while filing keeps the file square to the scribe lines and prevents the possibility of spoiling the work. As the extractor blank is filed closer to the finished dimension, it is smoked with soot, tri-fit, and filed for precision fitting. The barrels are turned vertical in the vise and the extractor radiuses are rough filed with a medium round file. A no-go gauge is used as a reference and guide during the rough filing. You have to be careful when rough filing in the chamber area so you don't slip and spoil the chamber's finish. It takes several repeated tries and filings to get the radiuses to fit correctly to the barrels. Rough filing the extractor's radius is complete when the chamber reamer will begin to fit down the barrels while the extractor is in place. A shotgun cartridge case head spaces on the thickness of the case rim. Head space is the measurement between the rear of the cartridge case and the receiver's bolt face. The reamer, which is turned by hand, cuts a rim into the extractor face and the face of the barrels simultaneously. The depth of this rim can vary only a few thousandths of an inch, so it has to be cut and tri-fit with the headspace gauges several times before the measurement is within tolerance. The final headspace dimension is reamed after the extractor tail and guide are silver soldered to the extractor.